Hey YouTubers, it's Ken from KBD Productions TV. Welcome back to another Ken Domic food review just for you. I am in the beautiful area of Muskoka, Ontario, Canada, in a little tiny town called Bala, and it is raining, it is a miserable day. It's Monday and I needed to shoot a food review. There's no fast food places around here, so I thought I'd do something that's a staple in this area of Muskoka. People come from all over the place to Don's Bakery, grabbed myself the stuff, came in here, it's a Chelsea bun. Uh, as I was in there getting out, I got a text from the people at the cottage, back at the cottage, they said, get us some butter tarts or pecan tarts or whatever. So I had to get those as well. So the Chelsea bun itself came to 10.75. The pecan butter tarts uh, came to th or uh, 3.50 each, so 14 bucks. And after, I guess there's no taxes on this stuff here at the bakery. I guess because it's baked goods. Uh, so it's 24.75. Oh, it's heavy. That is, and you can hear the train in the distance maybe, which is kind of fun. Little town, trains going through, beautiful waterfall over here. Oh, and then we're gonna be eating some Chelsea bun. Whoa, he's going right behind me. Canadian Pacific. For all you train enthusiasts, oh boy, oh, like I said, sticky, sticky buns. Ooh la la. So it almost looks like Christmas cake, their, their version of the Chelsea bun. Let me know in the comments below if you've had Chelsea bun before, if it looked anything like this. As she put it in the box, I'm like, how am I gonna do a food review of this in my car? And then I sat in the car and then I realized I need a knife and fork. Went back in, got the knife and fork, came back out here. And as I was thinking about doing this for you guys, I was thinking there's no way, it's gonna be so sweet that I'm gonna need something to drink with it. So I went back in there and grabbed a coffee. This is called Bear Black Bear Coffee. $1.75 uh, insulated cup and this is the coolest thing right here it's got an on off switch to the coffee itself I haven't tried it yet but that's the off switch and it closes off I wouldn't want to like tip it upside down to see how good it is but I bet if you shake it around it doesn't it's actually coming out there and then you go like that flip it to the on button let's do a quick swale of this not bad quite strong I almost grabbed the uh, the decaf by accident. I'm like, oh, the Black Bear Coffee is decaf? What kind of a name is Black Bear Coffee? And then it's decaf. She's like, oh, sir, the, the, the non-decaf is right here. I'm like, thank you very much. Uh, the coffee itself is like, it got a nice kick to it. You, you wanna get up in the morning, have a Black Bear Coffee, holy smokes. I almost swore. <laughs> All right, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. There is the Dawn Bakery Chelsea bun. It is, all you can smell is cinnamon. Oh, it smells like just fresh baked goods with, it uh, looks like there's raisins in there and then it's topped with all this syrup. It's not syrup, it's, uh, I don't even know what you would call that. Just a glaze, but it's so thick and sticky. All right, I'm gonna take a bite. Again, I'm not a huge fan of this candied fruit that's on top, but uh, I wish they didn't put that on there. Let's take a bite, guys. I'm glad I got that coffee. This is gonna be crazy sweet. The cinnamon is awesome. It's swirled with cinnamon inside. I asked the lady in the shop when they actually bake these. She says sometimes they do it overnight, sometimes very early in the morning. And I wish I got here at 7.30 in the morning when they open to get this when it was like piping hot right out of the oven. Right now it's it's been sitting around for about four hours. So uh, it's not cooled completely down. And uh, But it is still tasty, very tasty. And this is the last one too. I'm not sure how many they make in a day, but they sell out every day. This is gonna come in handy, let me tell you. All right, ladies and gentlemen, like I said, the only way you can make this particular Chelsea bun any better is to get here at 7.30 when it's just coming out of the oven and it's all gooey and warm. Oh, that's nothing better than a hot Chelsea bun and take the, uh, the, the candied fruit off it. That would make this a go out and get it now. But right now, it is good enough to do a hunger alert just for you. Are you ready? Oh, here we go. I wanna get a nice big gooey part. Here we go. Mm. Mm. 
Okay, with that bite I just had, I experienced something completely different. There was like a little pocket of raisins in there, which really helped out. Again, because it's cold now, it's not as warm as it should be. Uh, this is getting kind of like dry uh, because it's been sitting there for four hours. It'd be nice if you nuked it, but the raisins really helped get me through that little spot. You definitely need to heat this up. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I am gonna polish the rest of this off and I'll be right back. Hang on. All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, that Chelsea bun was fantastic. On my rating scale, I'm gonna give it a total recommend. Again, the only way you could get that up to a go out and get it now is to come here at 7.30 when it's fresh out of the oven and take off the candied fruit and it would be a go out and get it now. That's my recommendation from me to you and from me to Don's Bakery. I'm sure there's a lot of people like the candied fruit on there. I don't. So we're gonna do a quick bonus for you guys. Check that out. That looks amazing. It looks like almost everyone has the same amount of pecans on it, or pecans, as I'm pretty sure some people say. I say it the way I say it. All right, here we go. Let's do a little quick bite, quick review of this. See if this is better than the Chelsea bun. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. Here we go. Mmm, it smells so good. Mmm. Yeah, this is better than the Chelsea bun, people. Mmm much more rich, definitely sweeter, more candy, more sugar. Mm, not too sweet though. Mm. I'm gonna put this back in there. So the people at the cottage open it up. They'll be like, hey! <laughs> I'm so mean. Okay, on my rating scale for the pecan tarts, they are a go out and get it now. Super fantastic, loved it. Don's Bakery, good job on you, sir. I'd like to thank all my subscribers and viewers for watching and supporting this channel. Thank you very much. If you're new to this channel and you wanna see more of these food reviews, click the subscribe button right here and click that notification bell so you get notified the next time I make a food review in a small town in Ontario, Canada. But if you enjoyed watching this video and you wanna show some support, hit that thumbs up button, ding, 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 and we'll see you next time on another Kendomic food review. Kendomic out. Boop. I am in the beautiful, where, where am I? Um, how am I gonna get this out of here? And then just go back and forth from your tart, no, from. It's Bala. You don't need a car alarm. I forgot where I was, damn it. I hate that. If you don't let me go first, I'll murder you, she said to her kid. It was a joke. I don't think we need to call anybody. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Ah! All right, guys, thanks for watching. Talk to you later, bye.